Hey guys, it's Chris Reinecker. I'm the actor, writer, producer, chicken watcher, misheard lyricser, taste tester, previously a BuzzFeed video. I left BuzzFeed after being there for two and a half years. I made over 240 minutes of content there, over two feature films lengthwise. If you put all my taste tests back to back, it's actually the length of Game of Thrones. That's not true. But I've been a little off the radar for the past six months. I wanted to check in and let you guys know what I've been doing, where I hope to go, and let you know why I've made the decisions I have. But I'm gonna be honest, I don't really like vlogs that much. Um, so I made my living making relatable content. You know, those awkward moments we all have. Oh, um, I didn't think you were gonna get up. Oh, what are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? Uh, what are we doing? What am I doing with my life? But I always thought I could get a little bit deeper. You know what I mean? But the filmmaking process didn't really allow for that there. Here, let me give you some visual aids. So, filmmaking is a collaborative process. You know, it takes a lot of different brains to make one thing. Uh, you know, you got a brain for writing, you got a brain for camera, you got a brain for acting, you, a brain for a whole bunch of different things. Small sets have dozens of brains, large sets have 50, hundreds, even a thousand. At BuzzFeed, one brain has to do it all, which is possible, but it begins to hurt your brain after. And I started thinking if I wasn't multitasking all the time, maybe I'd be able to make some better content. So I decided to, you know, just use my writing brain. And I've just been writing for the past six months. A whole bunch of stuff. I know it's not that exciting on Instagram, but it's gotta be done. What's going on, man? I wanted to raise horses. Of course, th there were some other things which a lot of people have covered. They own all your intellectual property. You're not allowed to do any projects outside of BuzzFeed. The growing integration of ads and move away from scripted content. Also, they fired one of my best friends and collaborators. But mainly, I just wanted to work out one thing at a time. So for the past six months, I've been developing a lot of film and television. But as I've been doing that, I keep on having these ideas for YouTube videos. And I like YouTube videos. I like making them. They're fun and they're quick. And I, I like sharing with you guys and hearing what you think. So I decided to make a YouTube channel on my own. And like a lot of YouTubers, I needed some sponsors. So um, I got to get used to this. Uh, this episode is sponsored by security cameras, which they installed for us. Um, security cameras uh, keeping you safe new channel. What can you expect to see here? Well, first of all, it's a place to collaborate with a whole bunch of new brains. I'll introduce you to some new people and we'll see some familiar faces that we're used to. Yo, you want to leave this party and smoke a little bit? But I'm doing a vlog. That's not how vlogs work. What? But I, I, I could do, you know, a song or whatever I want, really. Maybe even something dramatic. I waited for you. Denise? And you never came! <laughs> oh. Um, I could even do unscripted stuff. Or, um, I can do topical stuff. I can even illustrate my last point with a big choreographed dance. You see, when you're creating new videos every single week, you start to get a little bit tired. You justify it because it's getting clicked on. But, you know, I want to create big things. You know, and this is a series about creating videos for the internet. And I want to be able to do that through good writing with plot twists and villains. So please, su subscribe. Uh, subscribe here or here or wherever the button is, because I'll keep coming back every single week with a new video. Oh, um, and I gotta remind you again that this one is sponsored by Security Cameras. <laughs> Don't do it! Don't do it! The channel is Was that... Was that me?